for joining us. So I thought we'd do another couples containment therapy session, and this one's going to be partner stretches. So um, when we're out riding our bikes or doing something that is like running or anything, you need some extra stretches in your hip flexors and your lower back. So we're gonna work on a couple things like that. And you can do these with your partner. So grab your partner and um, have them go ahead and lay down. So we're gonna start off by um, lifting the right leg. And then you're going to just lightly put pressure on the other leg with your hand right here on the thigh bone and push back, but not too hard. And you need to listen to them and hear what they say if it's too far or not far enough. So just let me know. That's good? Mm -hmm. A little farther. A little further, okay. Because only they know what their body can take. So you have your flexed. You can have your foot flexed, yeah. Okay, so now bend the knee and then press it down to their chest and put a little bit of weight on this leg with your knee, but no, not too much pressure. So you're just going to open up the hip flexor a little bit. Okay, so now come up and we're going to pick up the hips and they can pick it up themselves. Roll it over. Cross, this, cross your leg over to the other opposite side and then gently press on the shoulder and on the leg. And this opens up the whole side body right here. Close your eyes. Relax. Now, take that leg, and we're going to grab the other ankle too, and you're going to pick up and slightly rock their hips back and forth. This feels really good, the person that's getting the, getting the massage. Okay, so now lift up the opposite leg, press down in the thigh gently. You can flex this foot and press. And just ask them how far they can go. A little farther. A little further. down gently on the bottom leg keep it flat and then just press gently here don't put too much weight on it just like listen to what they say I like to put the hip foot in my hip just keep the extra pressure you never want to overstretch somebody because you can really pull the tendons the wrong way so be very careful when you're in control So now take this leg, cross it over to the opposite side, pick up the hips. You're going to press on the shoulder here and on the thigh, side of the thigh. And open up. This part of the back is opening up in a twist. Now take the, this foot, pick it up and pick up the other foot again. Rock the hips back and forth. Then I like to do where I pick up my right foot, put it the ankle, and slowly drop the foot down. It's kind of a surreal feeling for the person that you're doing it to. Just gently rock it back and forth. Okay, so now we're going to come into Happy Baby. So you're going to gently push down here with your knees. I'm, not, I'm barely putting any weight on him. Because you want your hip, this hip bone to get down to the floor as much as possible. Can you feel that? Mm -hmm. Does it hurt? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, now roll over and come into happy baby. 
What are we doing? <laughs> you said have your baby. Yeah, I'm sorry. Roll over coming in child's pose. Okay, so I'm going to scoot forward a little bit. I'm just going to put some pressure here. Just lay down. into downward dog. Right. He's in downward dog, so I'm going to press here on his lower back a little bit. Like I said, don't, do, don't go overdo it or do anything that's too much. Okay, come back down, sit on your knees. Scoot forward a little bit. Okay, can I actually put your feet in front of you? And yeah, just come into wide knees, feet together. Yeah, and lean forward. I'm just getting into the lower back, to the sciatica. back up. Now lay on your stomach. This is one that I did for my friend. She has some lower back problems and the PT told her to have her do this. So I you put as much pressure as you can on the lower back and you're going to kind of do upward dog but not go all the way up. Don't lift your hips. Just lift your upper body. One. Do you feel it? Uh-huh. Let me come back down. Two. Back down. Three. Let's do three. I'm putting a lot of pressure on his lower back to open it up. Okay, so now lay on your side. Lay on your right or left side. Okay, bring this knee up to your chest. And then we do the stretchy elbows really quick. Flip over. Okay, now sit up on your butt and cross your leg. Here, you sit up, sit up. Okay, so now you're gonna, he's going to cross his right leg over his left, cross, roll this around. Okay, so then you're going to reach around, and I'm just going to assist him a little bit here. Do you feel it? Is that mm -hmm. okay? That's good. Okay, always just ask him if it's feeling okay. Can I come up the other way? Gently, gently assist. Okay, switch legs. We're gonna, so you switch your legs around and then you're gonna go the opposite direction. So this arm's gonna come up. Cross over, and then we come back here. Is that feel okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, come back the other way. Okay, so now. Um, come out, come up for a second. Stand up? Yeah. Um, do wide leg. Here. We're going to do a triangle. So you're going to come forward like this. Do a triangle. Come up with your arm. And then I'm just going to energy your back up, open up a little bit right here in the chest. Not too hard. Gently push on the lower back. Okay, come up, switch sides. Make the right foot forward, left foot, yep. Open up the chest. And I'm just putting a little pressure on the back of his rear with my leg. 
I don't think I was stressed. Should we turn around so no. you can see? I don't think they can see. I think it's okay. Okay, come on up. All right, lay down, child's pose. Wide legs, wide knee, wide knee, child's pose. Let me just do this again really fast. Now roll over on your back. You're going to come up and like just lift his shoulders up a little bit, open up his chest, cock his neck open, throat open, press on the shoulders to relax. Then you just gently rub your fingers over their eyelids, massage the ear lobes, the ears, rub the hair a little bit, a little scalp massage, and temples. And then finish with your finger in the center of the third eye. Release, and then kiss. How's that? Amazing. Good. Okay. I hope you guys enjoyed the couple's massage therapy. I want you guys to try it out. Uh, let us know what you think. If you have any other ideas that you'd like to add to it, let me know and we can do another video. All right. Thanks so much.